Greetings, toy heads, and welcome to another episode of Go Figure with me, your host, Eli Williams. And today we are going to be assembling the Marvel Legend series Zabu build a figure. Finally, I got all the pieces and we're all ready to put him together. So let's dive in because Kazar, 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 I don't know, tomato, tomato, he's waiting on him, nevertheless. So, um, I just, uh, yesterday I did the, uh, I posted, I didn't do it yesterday, I did it this weekend, this past weekend, uh, I did the unboxing and review of the Thor, uh, Black Winter Thor, and got the head, um, had a bit of a problem, I ordered one from Amazon, I got it, and it didn't have, the, somebody had bought that, taken the head out, and then returned it, uh, with a different head thing in there it was it was the little the robot head that comes with the uh anniversary hulk and i thought that was kind of cheap but uh amazon did me good they did a then an exchange and i got all that taken care of so that's good um the body and the uh rear left leg um the body i think came with uh wolf's bane and the right rear leg right uh the left if rear leg came with I think Red Widow, either or, but I didn't want those two figures, so I outsourced them from eBay and Mercari. So let's get in here. Uh, let's grab the body. We'll put the legs on. Um, let's see if we can get that to snap in there. Oh, yeah, there we go. All right, that one's in. Uh, let's go ahead and put this one in. Uh, it's a little tough to get him in there, but, uh, yeah, managed to do it. Okay. And then we will put the front right on here. Actually, let's put them both in there and we can squeeze them together and get them in there. The ball joints are really tight. Okay. That one's in. I get that one in? Nope. I have to use some behind the camera strength here so I can use the palms of my hand. There we go. Okay, now we can put the head on and we got it. Zabu. Already to rock and roll. Very cool. Very, very cool. Um, looking at articulation with this, um, it's like most, this is actually a little bit bigger than most of the um, animals coming out of Hasbro has been. Um, the head, you do have a you do have this mane that's a that's a separate piece um and it, it looks like it yeah okay so it it does have a detent on it um that yeah you can get that to arc back a little bit so you've got uh you've got a swivel motion or a uh, hinge motion up and down through that and then with the uh, head on a ball joint, that gives you on the on this also turns too. But yeah, you can see there there is a uh, definitely a slider back there where you can move that mane up and down. And then with the head, you've got that on a swivel, so you got full rotation on the head and an up and down and a left and right. And the jaw opens, so you have that as well. Uh, the jaw opening up there. And then back to the, the front legs right here where you've got uh, full motion up and down. They actually swivel all the way around. And then you've got the forward motion on the front leg. And then the claw uh, has, a, has detents and a rocker on it. And then you've got the swivel on uh, the, the uh, I don't wanna say elbow, but uh, the joint on there um, as well. And then you've got a ball joint mid torso giving you some 
uh, back and forth motion and some swivel and, and some actually pretty good up and down. You can get that, you can get him haunched up like that. And then uh, back here with the rear legs again, full swivel around or uh, full rotation around and then you've got the pivot and swivel uh, on those legs and then you're double jointed here so you have a hinge uh, there a hinge there and then again det detents on the feet and a rocker on the feet so you can get him in a sitting position if you so desire and then the tail has a hinge on it and uh, a swivel all the way around and a does not have a pivot um, but uh, yeah we can definitely definitely get him in some crazy poses so yeah let me get I got Kazar Kazar down here and we'll put them together so you can see them together um, although it's focusing on uh, it's focusing on Zabu here we'll move him back a little bit uh, there we go so that's awesome that's awesome I'm thoroughly thoroughly happy about that I'm gonna get I'm gonna give him a nine out of ten uh, because that's <laughs> It's, that's a lot of articulation uh, and it was definitely worth it was definitely worth the the hunting and searching and buying to get him uh, so I could have him with uh, Kazar or Kazar I don't know how you pronounce it <laughs> and I don't really know that much about the character all I knew was this guy looks like a prehistoric badass and he's got a big cat and I wanted them both on my shelf and now I got them and I'm thoroughly happy about it so yeah Nine out of ten for me on the old Zabu there, uh, with his piercing green eyes and his—I don't know—it's just a great looking, great looking figure, and uh, he pairs well with uh, Kazar. I'm gonna say Kazar instead of Kazar. I'm gonna say Kazar. I figured that's probably right. So. Anyway, that will do it. A uh, little short episode there, but I just wanted to assemble him and get him together and um, experience that with you guys uh, and share it with you like I always do. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Curse, smash that bell so you can get information on all the good things coming out of my channel. You all have yourselves a great week and a great day. I'll see you next time. And until then, don't forget to get your figure on. Take care.